Okay, here's a uh, little quick video. Got the batteries in yesterday uh, afternoon, late when my neighbor came over to help me. And if you do like I did, I bought an EG2 version 4 for the top battery so I could get the screen. These foldable handles hit the bus bar. I slid the battery in, took the handles off. Another thing I'm going to do, this is some shrink wrap. It's inch and a half flat. Perfect size to cover these bus bars. I got a black one on this side. I mean a red one and a black one on this side for the negative. Something else I noticed, you pull down on this little lever. This door comes off. And now for another surprise, you come around to the back of the cabinet, which my neighbor spotted. I didn't see it because I had too many other things on my mind. There's three screws. Take those three screws out and look at this. There's a whole nother door. I'm doing this with my phone, so I don't really know what I'm doing. And look, you pull this little button down, that little latch, a pin, and this door comes off. Same with the front. Pretty sweet. That is an awesome setup. I am so happy with that. So that's the latest update on the EG4 cabinet build. That's just fantastic. Oh, and one other thing, the communications they give you, cable, which I was told is just a standard cable. These gray ones are not long enough to come from this part of the battery over here to the side ports on the version 2. So that's no big deal. All right, that's update number three on the EG4.